These three drills are gonna keep you entertained when you're working on your own, practicing your bowling skills. The first one is focusing on where you're pitching the ball and how you're landing the ball, whether you're a seamer or a spinner. So get yourself a little pitch map down, a little zone on a good line and length, and put in a perfect ball. So in this example, we've used a hurdle for you to focus on actually landing the ball through. The second part of the drill is getting something to see where the ball is finishing up. So in the hoop, for example, just outside off stump, we're focusing on hitting a channel, but that hoop can actually be moved in different places to work on various deliveries. The third is actually putting an obstacle in place. So in this example, I've stuck a pad on a set of stumps, and this is where you've got to work around the pad as a spinner or try and clip off the, uh, the white pad, almost envisioning an outside edge. These obstacles can change, the pitch on the floor can change, and of course, as I've already said, the hoop can change. But these tiny little details with inside the drill are gonna keep a, a more of an entertainment factor with inside quite a, a mundane and boring exercise. If you're able then to kind of implement your own complications or your own competitive nature, again, it's gonna allow you to train that a little bit harder, stay a little bit more focused, and hopefully get the most out of your bowling.